السلام عليكم ورحمة الله السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته I'm just gonna keep my uh, try to be respectable to everyone okay but fraud by Cobra America I'm against that's why I'm doing what I'm doing okay because it is too much and now the, again the state and the federal government and telling you who did what and when bend over and take it like a man sorry if you can put it in a better way please do okay I bought this I don't remember when because I have problems okay too much skittles which I like thank you fellas uh, this e-force 22 inch long strong it's a it's a fine racket all right and I had it don't remember again why I don't remember because I've been shopping at this place for the last almost 30 years or 25 years how's that to be conservative uh, buying all my sport you know tennis shoes running shoes everything shirts and you know stuff not this one but anyway, I got it out of my bag. I went, you know, my back bag, which is, you seen it, uh, somewhere. My room in Delaware, my office in Delaware is kind of messy. But anyway, and it, it cracked. It, it's, uh, I think it's vibe, fiber, whatever you call it, and it has aluminum from the inside, but it, it cracked. I don't know why. It's disturbing. It looks like somebody put a, a spell on it or something. See? All right? It's a nice, fine racket. And I like it because it's long, it's light, It's but now can't. So I went to the store, one of the stores, different city, and I said, well, you know, near the... I was going to the gym. I want to play my racquetball. And I explained to the manager, you know, the first one is, oh, wow, did you, you have a receipt? No. I have my social security card, government money that I'm supposed to be getting my Skittles and buy food with it. And transportation that, you know, but anyway. <laughs> oh, you got to bring me the receipt. I bought a couple of other things because... Uh, Plus my Ray-Ban glasses and I buy sunglasses. Anyway. And I bought another E-Force. I don't like it as much as this one, but, you know, it was in sale. I got it. This one was almost, uh, it was like 79 plus tax. That's another thing I'm going to talk about after, after I finish with this. Um... And it was 60% uh, off or something. So that's an expensive racket right there. This is very expensive one. Okay. Now, I bought this one here. And, I, you know, I didn't want to pill it because, you know, you handle with the gloves and everything. You see, it looks old, but it is, this is a new racket. You see, this is always happening there. Okay. And um, But it's a new racket. And the first couple of weeks when I got it this thing came loose and I have to put it together you know but that's I'm not complaining about that anyway it's it's a good racket beside you know it's just cracked I don't know why didn't hit it or anything here this one I got it's a e-force also it, it, it looks thicker here it's not as light but I like it anyway and he went in, went in refund me. So I made a video at the store and I'm going to put it there. And um, I am going to go after Big Five. Not only for me, to stop fraud and people. Fraud. Fraud. You want my business? You want our business punks? Come through with, with your stuff. Don't, don't do that. Glasses, I buy the glasses every time I buy them in sale. And they're supposed to be, the lenses are supposed to be replaceable for free. Uh, you know, they, 
becomes gets scratched and it, it's unbelievable unbelievable and uh, we pay pretty penny i buy expensive stuff well, yeah well i buy it in sales but name brands i don't you know and the, most of us do that and you know it's, it's unbelievable so i need a refund for this because i spend 140 dollars in, in the stuff that i bought uh, and uh, okay better call me better i'll call the corporate office i'll make them a deal an offer they can refuse <laughs> i need my money for my racket take your racket back to taiwan or bangladesh or somewhere when you're not paying the people uh, to make all of these name brands there you know or in America, here, yeah. slave labor anyway is here, all right, uh, that's it, the second issue I want to talk about, the tax ID, resale, wholesale, don't pay tax, I have that number since uh, 2013, beginning of 2013, how's that, and I didn't have any money, and they're charging me tax and until now they say oh well bring proof and bring this and bring punks i don't need to bring anything you punks defrauding you out of everything i'm telling you proof <laughs> and the state is out oh, it's okay and the feds are okay they're saying oh yeah we're gonna come and get you you don't pay child support you don't pay your tax we take everything take your life <clears throat> so uh, we need our money, not only for Muhammad Shaban, for millions of others that you guys are frauding and uh, telling them who did what and when. Alrighty, uh, big five, big five. All right, here. Yeah. And I don't have a receipt. Call uh, Social Security Administration and tell them this fellow here taking too much skittles. They will know. They will recognize. United Healthcare, whatever it is, biggest drug dealers. Okay, please, need my money. Okay, I'm gonna call Cobra and record the call with this video, the other one I made in the store. And good luck, fellas. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.